What's up everybody, I'm Bua, and this week on American Revolutionaries, we're checking out Edward Weston's eloquent nude. His whole life was spent photographing Karis, uh, his lover, his muse, and it was a documentation of her body. And a lot of artists through the history have painted or photographed the nude. But what is the line between pornography and just an exploration of the nude body? Because, you know, Maplethorpe, in a lot of ways, his, photo his photography is considered art. But at the same time, a lot of people really consider pornography. Uh, Playboy magazine, good example. A lot of people consider that art. Hefner, obviously, uh, <laughs> but a lot of people consider it pornography. I teach classical figure drawing at USC, and I have nude models all the time. I've been doing it for like ever. I've been drawing the figure forever, and I definitely consider that an art. But I know a lot of people get offended by that. You know, I've had students doing about face come into class and like, I don't think so. You know, like that's offensive to them. And I know a lot of people think. Nude figure drawing can be offensive. In fact, I know some studios here in LA where they actually make the models cover up. And I've seen people too, like in my class, when they're drawing the figure, they won't draw the genitalia. They just do it like a Ken doll or a Barbie doll that's all smooth down there. But, you know, where's the line draw, be, drawn? Because a lot of people really think it's pornographic or it's art. What do you think? Thank you.